and, and chaperones me, and and it's cool. It's really cool. It's great. And then sometimes you get like a really good friendship out of out of it. And we've just had a blast together this whole time. We totally bonded. We've had some long drives. We got into some deep sauce, some serious talks where it was like, really, really? we should pull the car over. Let's let's get this out of us. So um, it's been pretty rad. And I, I'm really lucky that that my symbol company cares that much. To they could just get me a rental car, but they don't. They send a rep with me to make sure that I don't oversleep like the second morning, <laughs> or we almost missed our flight. Montreal, we made it. Um, but you know, it, it's, it's an amazing thing. So, and Zach's a great percussionist, so you need to know this is not even kind of rehearsed. I've honestly never heard this dude play percussion. I just said, you, you're a percussionist, right? And he's like, yeah. And I was like, dude, go grab some stuff from back there. So no idea what's gonna happen, so that's Zach. That. Now my other person I'm gonna bring up is one of my students, online only. His name is Joey Porth. Come on up, Joey. Hello, Joey. Yeah, hi. Hi. Joey has been one of my online students for about three years now? Two years? Uh, about three years. Three years. Um, and, you know, once again, at Mike'sLessons.com, we have a pretty tight-knit family. And yeah. yeah. Yeah, we do. Darn right we do. Uh, and in that family, there is no, oh, he's really good for a kid. There, we don't do that. Oh, she's really good for a girl. Oh, he's still playing after all those years? That's great. It doesn't work like that. You play drums. Play them, have fun. I don't really care about your age. I don't care about your gender. I care that you are getting better every day. That means the world to me. I'm obsessed with it. And Joey's been getting better every day. So when I heard that we were gonna be close enough that we could play together, I was like, we should play. Here's the problem. We didn't have time to play. So we're just gonna play drums for you right now with no clue what we're gonna do. But I wanna show you that drummers being together, it doesn't have to be a shed. You know what a shed is, if you don't know, it became something, it was something great, it became something not so great. And it became, let's all play at the same tempo and just go as fast as you can, then I'll go as fast as I can, then you go as fast as you can, then you go faster, and then I go faster. And it just, it became very competitive. And it's, it's exactly what I don't think drumming should be about. I don't mind doing that with another drummer for about eight seconds just to warm up, but after that, if drums are gonna be in the same room as each other, shouldn't they be playing something that can't be played on one kit? I don't want to play the groove you're playing. I don't want to play the feel you're playing. I want you to fill in the cracks. I want Joey to be playing things that I can't be playing while I'm busy playing my drum set. And I want Zach to be adding texture to things that I can't do because I'm busy playing drums. So honestly, I just thought, to, I'm not going to see him. I'm going back to the States tomorrow. He's going back to the States. But I get a new rep tomorrow. And then he's just not going to live up to Zach. <laughs> and, uh, you know, and, and then having Joe here, I just thought it'd be fun. So we're going to play for you, and then we're going to give some stuff away, and then I'll be in the back to talk to you guys, and I'll totally chastise you if you're like, hey, that thing on your bass drum? I'll be like, seriously, bro? You had your, temp, you had your chance. Now, we can talk about anything. So uh, we'll see what happens.